When downloading Active Inspire, you have two versions of the software to choose from. The Personal Edition is free for anybody to use. The Professional Edition is one that you have to have a license for by either owning a set of the student responders or an active board or by purchasing the license for the software itself. To load the software, you need to go to prometheanplanet.com and log in. On the far right here, it says Download Active Inspire. Click on that link. Choose the language that is appropriate. Then you get to choose how or what you want to do next. You can watch uh, tips on how to use the software itself watch how the software is used or you can simply select the yellow gold button that says download version 1.3. Choose the, the computer platform that is appropriate for you. Fill out the entire form that appears in front of you and the ones that are asterisk are the ones that you really need to fill out. Hit submit on the form. The next thing that will happen once you hit submit is that your download should automatically start. Now if you'll notice, I can move my download window off to the side and there's several things to pay attention to at this point. There is a software download, but there is also a clip art package that you need to download. So there are two downloads on this link. If you'll notice about halfway down, on the left hand side it says get your free Active Inspire resource pack. You need to select the one that's appropriate for you. In this case the USA Mirror is the one that I would pick. So while the software package itself is downloading, I still need to also download the resource pack. When you go to run the software, everything will appear just as normal. You put it on your C drive and all those kinds of good things and then You'll be greeted with a screen in the middle that looks kind of like this. You'll be prompted to put in your serial number, which actually should have appeared on the previous screen. You need to make sure and write down the serial number as it appears on the website right as the download is happening. Otherwise, uh, you will need to have a separate Inspire license number, whether it comes in your board package or um, in your Active Ex Expression Kit. The organization and the username really does not matter. That's for your own personal use. Just the serial number as well as selecting OK to run the professional edition and then you should be all set.